Hi Sagittarius, it's Elle here to do your oracle reading for this week. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It is much appreciated. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's go ahead and jump into this Sag. Thank you Lord God for blessing Sagittarius with a clear, concise message from you. Okay, so Sagittarius, we have a sudden wealth. We have concern. We have message. Okay, so it looks like somebody's going through a lot of grief here. Okay, suddenly a lot of grief. And now they want to send out a message here. Well, they've sent out a message or a message could come to you in any mode whether it's text message, phone, email, an actual, you know, you know, letter from in the snail mail, I don't know. Um, the sender, so the receiver might get the message, but they might not respond here is what the, what the cards say. Somebody's going through a lot of grief and they're a little depressed here, maybe because the ending of a relationship or something ended here something is a no-go and the other person who ended it is going in a new path or going on a new path here so all of a sudden someone is feeling a lot of grief because they're off balance or something is out of balance or off kilter or the power dynamic has been shifted maybe this person had you know this person and another person and then the one person that they do love or like the most, they left the connection, leaving this person in a very pessimistic, depressive state. And now somebody wants to reach out, give a message um, about this ending here. Um, let's see what's going on here. This could be you, this could be another person. Someone feels like somebody got some like divine intervention happen or they got some message from someone else someone wants to surprise the other with a message or a gift of jewelry an engagement ring with the true gem here and that could be unexpected especially coming from um, this person it talks about uh, the unexpected coming from the least expected person here so this could be you Sag. it could be the other person um, Whomever got left or whomever is in this depressive state. Someone could have gotten left because there was a hidden person here. Someone also could have left the other woman or somebody put an ending to um, an extra relationship. Um, a relationship on top of a relationship. A relationship outside of the relationship you had before. Somebody put an ending to that relationship here with the brunette uh, female. And there's new love or somebody's going to have a new lease on life uh, for themselves first. And then they also want to have a new love or a rekindling of a love. Somebody couldn't take the fact that someone else leaving and made them very depressed, very sad. Um, there could also be another woman leaving the dynamic. If somebody feels like they won or they hit the jackpot or, yeah, they won something or that it's completely over. This mature man may have a lot of options in women or with women, this could be someone who's balding or going gray or someone who has a lot of life experience. Um, that's what they have to give and share. This person doesn't always want to either be in a commitment or get remarried. If they do, it's gonna be something that takes time with the mature man here. Let's see, money, it looks like somebody's giving money. Someone feels like they hit the jackpot. But again, you might be dealing with an ice king, someone who is okay being the loner, someone who knows a lot. Again, sharing life uh, lesson and uh, maturity could be a philosopher or someone who stands up for other people, maybe even a lawyer. Destiny and spiritual growth here. It was um, des the hand of destiny that stepped in for someone and offer spiritual growth here and maybe that's why there's a party who left here there's someone who left because this relationship this situation had no growth 
it was going nowhere fast so they put an end to it and now someone is seeing what they lost it looks like they're going to give a message to this person um okay someone is saying I, I want to propose marriage to you but i'm so scared we saw that with true gem coming out it's like somebody now wants you now that you've gone you've left um let's see okay um somebody unfair treatment someone treated the other person very unfairly um someone uh, i fight the feelings i have for you i will not let love in and we saw that with the ice king um he's typically not looking for love he could be the loner he's okay with that he'll have relationships or relations but he's not looking for a relationship um someone's saying you think you're so mature but you aren't especially with this mature man um and because someone's saying i just like hearing myself talk Someone will just, they just talk and they just say anything um, just to sound philosophical or smarter than the other person. Um, interested in reading. Yeah, um, some days, okay, so I sleep around some days. I find nothing wrong with this and some days I need help. So someone knows that they're off and on in terms of their sexuality and their promiscuity. Um... It could have caused a lot of problems in a connection. Someone left the connection because of promiscuity. But now someone is asking that they, their prayers be answered. And their prayers are answered with the 333 card here showing up. Someone does have intimacy issues. Um, not sexual issues, but intimacy. They don't know how to let people in. How to be vulnerable. How to have truthful, honest connection. Caring connection. Uh, let's get a few more and then we're going to close this out. Um, the universe, this person, someone wants you to know that you give too much or someone was giving too much. Someone is definitely trying to bring you back into their energy because they're saying I masturbate to the thought of you. Ooh, okay. And this is what I was saying. This card has not come out in such a long time. But this really solidifies what I was saying in terms of someone left the connection and now somebody wants them back because they are in great despair. They're in great, they're in a depressive state without this person because women fall in love in the presence of and men fall in love in the absence of. So there, there could have been a woman who left a man and now he, the man is realizing that now that she's gone, I actually love her. Women fall in love in the everyday, in the presence. I need to be around him. I need to see him. I need to talk to him. Men actually realize that they're in love when there's absence there. So it looks like somebody is realizing that they're in love. This could be an older man and a younger woman. We saw that with mature man. Um, it looks like somebody is realizing that they are in love with the person that left them. Left them to their own devices. Left them because they could not control themselves sexually and they had other parties here. Interesting reading. If it resonates for you, go over to the website, book your own reading there. If you're trying to bring newness into your life, um, get a, be a part of the New Moon Manifestation session that is happening July 9th, this Friday. Um, you can click the link below and get a, and be a part of that session. Um, if you want to bring in new love, new streams of income, if you want to banish a person, place, or thing, or a situation, or a feeling, you want to banish fear, anxiety, be a part of the manifestation session happening July 9th, this Friday, on the new moon. Um, if you want to get your own oracle reading like this one, you can go over to the website, book your oracle reading. If you have a question or two, you can text your question to the number below pay for your question, receive the answer to your question on your mobile device. You can also donate to the channel by clicking the buy me a coffee link. Thank you, Sag. Many blessings to you. Take care.